Okay, hello dear friends, here we have another problem. How we solve this? When we see problem, we see where we can start. 25, 125, there is, they are not the same number. We cannot factor in, we cannot compute, we cannot do anything right now. But you will find the relationship between 25 and 125. 25, uh -oh, they are all related to a magic number 5. So in my class, I usually say magic number. For example, if you find something you can factor in, the, the, a common factor, well, I say that is a magic number. And here there is a, a magic number. It's not factoring, but they are both to the power of a certain number. And the basic relation, those two numbers based on one number that is the key in solving this problem, that is 5. 25 is, 25 is 5 to the power of 2, right? 125 is 5 to the power of 3. And 1 over 125 is the negative of 5 to the power of, uh, uh, let's say, it's a 5 to the power of negative 3. With this equation established, this equation and this ex equation established, we can plug in. 5 to the power of 2 instead of 25, 5 to the power of negative 3 instead of 1 over 125. Now we can do computation. So 5 to the power of 2 times 20x plus 4 equal 5. We are replacing this number. <coughs> 5 to the power of negative 3 times 4 minus 3x. Does it make sense? They are on the same base. If they are on the same base, the power, the number with the same base is equal. It means the power is equal to the power. <clears throat> May the force be with you. <laughs> May the force be with you. Okay, I will not joke around. So 20, uh, no, <clears throat> 2 times 20 equals 40 plus 2 times 4 is 8. Oh, I forgot the x sign. 8 equal negative 12. Negative next, negative makes positive plus 9x. Move this one around, this side, neg minus 9x, minus 9x, so 31x equal negative 20. And x equal negative 31 out of 20, right? To make sure we know this solidly, we do another problem. x to the power of x minus 1 equal 1 over 16 to the power of 4x minus 3. <clears throat> now we need to find the commonality between the base, 8 mm -mm -mm, related to 2, 8 equal 2 times 2 times 2, so 2 to the power of 3, 16 equal 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, so 2 to the power of 4, and 1 over 16 equal 2 to the power of negative 4. Now we can do 
to eight instead of writing eight we write down two to the power of three times x minus one equal and one over sixteen we do not write one over sixteen we wrote two to the power of negative four and 4x times 3, we will honestly do the change, only replace the <clears throat> equality, only, only, only change a way of writing it. It's still the same equality. With the same base, the power should be the same. 3x minus 3 equal negative 16x plus... 12, right? We did not change anything, just to plug in the number. <clears throat> so, negative 16, move to this side, 19x, and negative 3, move to this side, equal 15. So, x equal 19 over 15. I think two is enough, right? Let's see if we have the third one. Okay, three is always better. <clears throat> 36 to the power of 10x plus two equal one over six to the power of 13 minus x find the commonality 36 equals 6 to the power of 2 1 over 6 equals 6 to a power to the power of negative 1 so replace 36 with 6 to the power of 2 6 to the power of 2 times 10 x plus 2 equal 6 to the power of negative 1 times 13 times 13 minus x, right? So, <clears throat> same base to the power of the same equals the whole number the same. So, the power should be the same. They have the same power. 20x plus 4 equals negative 13 plus x move x around uh, 19x equal negative move 4 to this side negative 17 x equal negative 17 over 19 make sense now we are done